What do I know about God? Who am I trusting? Continue looking at verse 1. In the day of trouble, the Lord delivers him. The Lord protects him, keeps him. Right? He does not give him up to the will of his enemies. The Lord sustains. The Lord restores him to full health. What do I know about God? Who am I trusting? I'm trusting the God who delivers, protects, keeps, does not give up to the enemy, sustains, and restores. This is what I know, not how I feel. Because it's not based on how I feel. It's based on who God is. If I know, apart from my feelings, who God is, it helps me deal with my situation because you see, it's not based upon how I feel. I'm going to wake up some days and I'm going to feel crummy. And I'm going to wish that, that, that this world would just go away. And I'm not going to want to be encouraged or feel happy or giddy. And I'm going to be grumpy and it's going to be hard. But that, that, those feelings, they'll fluctuate, they'll change, they'll come and go, they'll move back and forth. So I need somebody who is not like me. You know, the old confessions uh, and the old church confessions, one of the sayings that was often used talking about who God is would say that God is without passions. He's, with, he's, he's without passions. And what that means is, is that God is not like us. He's not driven by emotion like us. You know, the gods of the Greeks and the Romans, they were just amplified humans. So the gods would get grumpy. So a bad hurricane, uh, that, that was just Poseidon being grumpy. Maybe Poseidon and Zeus were, were arguing about something. That's what it was. God is not like that. God is not driven by passions the same way that we are, and that is good. Because that means no, no matter what, God can be trusted. That God is steady. God is the solid foundation where we can plant our feet, and we can be certain that He can be trusted at all times. What do I know about God? God. 